ouais, ouais. No, it's still too dark. Thank you very much. We're just trying to get set up. Is anybody watching? Good evening and welcome to the show. <laughs> I'll leave it to right on seven o'clock to start uh, playing so you can all get tuned in. Brilliant, great, great, great. Well, good evening. It's great, great to see you all again. I can't really see you again, but it's nice, uh, nice to know that you're all tuning in and getting settled down. Uh, with some uh, more songs for tonight, including a few uh, new ones, or at least new, uh, new to me, um, requests from yourselves. But if you can join in at home, I'd love you to, to have a, have a sing and try and enjoy the next uh, about an hour, and uh, we'll, uh, we'll see you at the end. All right, here we go. Daylight never comes, some grow food upon the land and only get the crumbs. Some work on the assembly line and wish the time would fly. But give me a lot to roll a slab and set the sparks to fly. Hammer it, weld it, roll it to and fro. Cleveland steel is all the best that have you all to know. Forge it, cast it, roll it how you like. Meet a Geordie Hitty Bird. Tough as a Yorkshire tyke. Corn or Easter from the girl frees your very soul. Then it's the open heart for me and where the ingots roll. Where thunder rocks the walls around and trembles on the floor. And sparks jump out the smoking pit and sets roll down the law. Hammer it, weld it, roll it to and fro. Cleveland steel is all the best I'll have you all to know. Forge it, cast it, roll it down you like. Leave your jolly hinny bird, tough as a Yorkshire tyke. Dig iron by the wagon load and burn it till it's white Blast it through with jets of gas and turn your mixtures right Shut in your lumps of lime and make the sky to blow Add some spit and lots of sweat and make your steel to flow. Hammer it, weld it, roll it to and fro. Cleveland steel is all the best, I'll have you all to know. Forge it, cast it, roll it how you like. It's a jolly hinny bird, tough as a Yorkshire tyke. Hammer it, weld it, roll it to and fro. Cleveland steel is all the best, I'll have you all to know. Forge it, cast it, roll it down your like. It's a jolly hinny bird, tough as a Yorkshire tyke. Yeah. That's a great song, a great song written that, written by uh, Ron Angel. That's uh, my old mate Ron Angel, the late great Ron Angel. Brilliant song, he wrote. Uh, not many songs, Ron, but uh, those that he... he uh, Published were uh, crackers. It sounds like the Chemical Workers song and uh, really brilliant, brilliant uh, writer. We've got lots of brilliant writers in this area, as you well know. I um. The 
song called Land and Sea. Uh, you may have heard it uh, was recorded, at, although I wrote it, uh, was in on a CD called War Horse. And uh, <clears throat> it was recorded by Derek Gifford, I'm pleased to say. Thank you, Derek, for recording my song. <laughs> shore, the mountains and the sea, <clears throat> high over the polar caps, or deserts and ice fields, I listen to the wisdom in the wind that called to me, and listen as the bells rang out, for all our land and sea. The years you've made a profit as you filled the ground with holes. Send down your picks and shovels and drills for ore and coals. It's picking here and you in there Until the stone's all gone The land and people bear the scars While prophets are passed on Listen to the wisdom in The wind that called to me Listen as the bells ring out for all our land and sea <clears throat> Was profiteering killed the trees And laid the mountains bare The swift blade and the stock exchange Fell many forests fair it's profiteering to the root, just hear young timber tear. When they've had their fill, they close the mill, leave poisoned lakes and air. Listen to the wisdom in the wind that called to me. Listen as the bells ring out. For all our land and sea. <clears throat> On sailing day, fair wind or foul, you'd all be on the key. Cause when the fish were running, you could smell money. The years and years you fished the sea, the fish were always there. But now you're left with empty nets and species almost rare. Listen to the wisdom in the wind that called to me. Listen as the bells ring out. For all our land and sea. <clears throat> and then she whispered through the trees and said, This is your home. You've used up all your resources down to the bone. Gone to never be replaced, the story's long been sung. And then she sighed, make up your mind, before man himself is gone. Listen to the wisdom in the wind that called to me. Listen as the bells ring out. 
o'er all our land and sea. Listen to the wisdom in the wind that called to me. Listen as the bells ring out o'er all our land and sea. London Sea. <clears throat> That's a, it's a great song to sing. It's got uh, lots of uh, imagery for me anyway. I first wrote that when I was in the north, uh, on the west coast of North America. When I witnessed my first truly bald mountain. Mountains being stripped for lumber for trees and uh, nothing replaced. And so with a friend afterwards, uh, it was a very depressing night. We were talking about not just the trees growing, there's fish as well, you know, and they're digging holes in the ground and it's, oh yeah, there was a great bottle of whiskey. A whole night long talking about all the doom and gloom and a, and a bottle of whiskey. So um, <clears throat> I got a request from a, 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 a friend of uh, ours uh, called Mark. He's got a, he loves uh, this song. I wrote about uh, George Vancouver. Um, George Vancouver was a young lad that, uh, when he was 15, um, he was, uh, he became, uh, um, he joined the Resolution as a midshipman. Uh, the Resolution with James Cook as master. And uh, they did uh, another, tremendous voyage uh, and uh, sadly he actually um, witnessed Cook's murder and uh, must have left a mark on him but he was a bit of a childhood hero of his and uh, 30 years later he was chosen to as a master of the discovery to um, and rather than spending three years away on that voyage as he did with the, on the resolution with Cook his voyage um, charting the Pacific and the northwest coast of the states it was five years a man that did, uh, did so much and uh, didn't live to kind of uh, reap the benefits of his uh, achievements but after reading his biography it was uh, apparently written down by his brother at his uh, Sam is sick bed. Um, I wrote this song called George Vancouver. If you feel like joining in the chorus, I'd love to hear you. <laughs> Marinan, sorry, who is that? One, two, three. An English man and true in Norfolk I was born and I was raised up tenderly and true in Kingswin town. I've sailed the seven oceans, a captain bold at me, and my name is George Vancouver. Of many's the stormy sea on board Discovery. Mariners all, raise your glasses free. Remember George Vancouver, of many's the stormy sea on board Discovery. The tender eleventh year, my loving mother died, and three more years were to pass me, boys, till fortune on me smiled. But I was bound for sea, a midshipman's berth I took, in the good ship Resolution. 
and Abijah's crook, and landsmen I foresaw. Mariners all, raise your glasses free, and remember George Van Groover of Benny's the Storm at Sea, on board Discovery. By 19 I'd come home, I'd sail the world twice round, I'd sail through hell and paradise, but in me sleep no rest I found, for I witnessed the murder of Cook, that hero bold. John Williamson could have saved his life if me stories ever told. This will the truth unfold. Mariners all, raise your glasses free. Remember George Van Groover and Benny's the stormy sea. On board Discovery, the ocean rolled beneath me. And so the time did pass. I fought like fire for me country boys, till I won command at last. My ship Discovery did sail without delay to chart in distant oceans west of America. And so we made our way. Mariners all, raise your glasses free. And remember George Van Groover, the many's the stormy sea. On board Discovery. It was a hard old time we had, five years on stormy seas, and all the time by sickness boys, he lived his death from me. But the charts were unsurpassed, no voyage time so long, we charted Pacific Northwest coasts, and we took them for the crown, far away the death bell sounds. Mariners all, raise your glasses free, remember George Vancouver, and many's the stormy sea, on board Discovery. Got home to find no welcome, nor honour for my crew. I was treated like some pirate boys, but the truth they'll not subdue. A wreck discovery there, and the crew were all dispersed, and I was left to wait for pay. From His Majesty's service and the word of Thomas Pitt. Mariners all, raise your glasses free. Remember George Van Groover and many's the storm sea on board Discovery. Noble men of England, if indeed you noble be, God damn you for not honouring such a hero true as he. And you admirals take note, though your souls have long set sail, that will hunt and harry you in hell. Till Vancouver's name be hailed, and all men tell his tale. Mariners all, raise your glasses.
glasses free. Remember George Van Gogh, amazed the storm at sea on board Discovery. Some men sail great oceans, some never walk a key, some never feel the pull of the oar or the terror in a raging sea. But not so George Vancouver, a mariner next to none, who sail in the wake of Cook himself. And whose name it does live on, and so I sing my song. What's it? Mariners all, raise your glasses free, and remember George Van Gogh, and many's the story seen on board Discovery. glasses free and remember George Van Gogh of many's the storm we see on board discovery George Van Gogh, thank you very much <clears throat> it's great learning a song again after a few years of not even singing it and then of course you realise that next time I do it will be even better because it will be in the right key <laughs> there you go. Requests, Richard. I've got some requests on my word. Yeah, uh, John Richards. Hi, oh, hey, John. <laughs> You'd like Death and Nelson. Ah, uh, would you know? <laughs> That's a bit of a belt, isn't it? Um, I could do that, yeah. I could do it. Does anybody else know the Death of Nelson? I bet you do. Um, some people think it's traditional. In fact, some of the words are. Um, but uh, unbeknownst to me, um, I took these a few of the words anyway and made a new song. And uh, it's called Death and Nelson. And it's, the chorus is Marin is not. So it's, uh, it's, it's, it's not unlike George Vancouver, is it? Um, it's Let him die in peace. God bless you all on board a man of war. That's interesting. Let's have a go. <laughs> Two stories connected to this song. But I won't bore you, bore you with them tonight. Uh, yeah, well, we recorded this for the BBC once when I was in the Teesside Fettlers and we we're on the road and we'd called into Pebble Mill Studios to record this song. And uh, we had a lot of fun. It was uh, great. I sang quite a few songs for their uh, for the for the folk show, and uh, got to Death of Nelson, and we were really happy with it because we just worked out all these harmonies to it, and uh, we thought we were the bee's knees with this song. So we got on, got on, and sang it. Unfortunately, we weren't quite synchronised all the. Some of the lads weren't quite up to the uh, speed, if you like, of the song. So, um, Let Him Die in Peace came out like uh, Let Him Die in Pieces. It was quite funny getting it, getting it right. Because the rest of the guys, after I was singing, uh, how he's, I was told to sing the chorus in full. Uh, Let Him Die in Peace, God Bless You All, and so on. And so we got this C's, and, uh, not, you know, they were not synchronised, so this... It was a, this kind of thing was going on. So the four of the other lads had to sing in harmony, let him die in pee. Which I thought was quite funny, really, to see them in action. Here we go. Death and Nelson. Thank you, John Richards, for the request. I 
On the 21st of October, before the rising sun, we formed a line for battle, and the 12 o'clock begun. Old Nelson to his men did say, The Lord will prosper us this day. Set fire the broadside, fire away, On board a man of war. Let him die in peace. God bless you all, On board a man of war. Let him die in peace. God bless you all, on board a man of war. From broadside to broadside, the cannonballs did fly. By hailstone, the small shot across our decks did fly. Our main mast was blown away, besides some hundred on that day, were killed or wounded in the fray, on board a man of war. Let him die in peace, God bless you all, on board a man of war. Let him die in peace, God bless you all, on board a man of war. And then our brave commander, with grief he shook his head, there's no retreat, no relief, oh Nelson, he is dead. It was a fatal musket ball that caused old Nelson far to fall. Let him die in peace, God bless you all, on board a man of war. Let him die in peace, God bless you all, on board a man of war. Let him die in peace, God bless you all. On board a man of war again, let him die in peace. God bless you all, on board a man of war. Woo! Thank you, John. That was a bit of a, a live love, wasn't it, for the year? There's a few more John would like. <laughs> <laughs> John's taking over the show, everybody. Just hang on while John puts his question. Yeah. <laughs> no, he does. He, he might go down as well at some point. <laughs> All right, yeah. Okay. <clears throat> can I catch up now with the program? <laughs> I can. I can tell you some more requests or you can just get on with Oh, go on. Just give, give us some more requests then. Okay. Uh, where are we? Um, Lost it, lost it. Chemical workers' song. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, go on, what else? Uh, what was it again? Iron Steel, I think. All right, Iron Steel. I was going to do that next, so that's good. Uh, chemical workers' song. I was just thinking about that song last night. I might give that a crack before the end of the show. Well, I'll have a go. As you go down the road between uh, Eston and uh, and, uh, and Lackenby, Middlesbrough, see this huge rusting hulk of the old, what they call the boss plant. Massive, massive steel production plant, as was. And the magnificent Teesside steel complex they, they built, or were building in Redcar. All that's gone. That's a um, big blow to the area. My dad worked at the bridge yard, Teesside Bridge. My 
brother works at, uh, in fact, at the Red Castile works as a photographer. And members of the family, numerous members of the family, worked there from time to time. As I walk by the steelworks one fine summer's day I met with a young man come walking my way He said sometime soon mate I'll join the door queue Oh I'm losing my job and don't know what to do I went to me work as I do every day To work the hot steel in number nine bed I was just clocking on when they gave me the news Oh, but one thousand jobs is too many to lose Farewell to me comrades, the smoke and the flame Goodbye to the cabin, goodbye to the crane No more you build bridges, nor lay the long keel It's a way to the life of iron and steel Young lads with families and all the chaps too. Our circumstances mean nothing to you. Not a thought for me bands, not a care for me wife. After all of my loyalty, all my work in life. Farewell to me comrades, the smoke and the flame goodbye to the cabin goodbye to the crane no more you build bridges nor lay the long keel it's a way to the life in the iron and steel All you shareholders with comfortable lives With your quiet country mansions And your lunch and club wives You can count all your money Keep all your perks Maintain your precious profit While less of us work Farewell to me comrade The smoke and the flame goodbye to the cabin goodbye to the crane no more you build bridges nor lay the long keel it's a way to the life in the iron and steel from the bean mill, the bridge yard, the wagons and chains. Goodbye to the chimneys, the fifty foot flames. Goodbye to the place where I earned all my pay. Damn and blast all you furnaces, I'm moving away. Farewell to me, comrades, the smoke. And the flame. Goodbye to the cabin, goodbye to the crane. No more you build bridges, nor lay the long keel. It's a way to the light in the iron and steel.
let's do. Thank you very much. This is not vodka. I wish it was, though. It'd be great, wouldn't it? It's pure water. It's not really pure water. <laughs> <laughs> <clears throat> Nectar of the gods. <clears throat> water. Okay, this is a, a song. I'll, I'll just uh, do one more of these uh, of these songs about tea side and steel. Um, one of the very earliest songs I ever um, um, fiddled with. <laughs> song called Tea Side Bridges. Written originally by a lad called Eric Gooding. Impressed with the Teesside steel and the fact that all these bridges were made all over the world, and, um, railway wagons, but they, we became particularly famous for bridges. But in Middlesbrough, we've got two great bridges: what the Transporter Bridge, which is an icon of Teesside, and the fabulous uh, uh, Newport Bridge, Road Bridge. Both in the day, record breaking bridges. But in the meantime, of course, the T side have built lots of other bridges, like including the Tyne Bridge and, uh, and all the way over in Australia, the Sydney Harbour Bridge and bridges like the Fourth Bridge and Humber Bridge and all the, all the iconic bridges of the world, the Seven Bridge, have all been uh, built with T side steel. Uh, finishing off with um, Wembley Stadium. The great arc of Wembley Stadium is made of Teesside steel. Hey. If you're looking for fine bridges, then on Teesside we've got two to show what local engineers and labourers can do. There's one of them that lifts herself a mile to shipping way. And the other shuttles back and forth a hundred times a day. When I was just a college lad and living on a grant, I went and got a summer job at Dorman's Ackland Plant, where conditions for the workers never change in 50 years. And fumes of oil and manganese blew in the furnace place. The output of this plant you would be hard put to, to beat. We wiry types are toiling in the dry and ruddy heat. Why a firm that makes a finer steel? Now tell me if you can. For this furnace made the very steel for Sydney's harvest span. Here we go. If you're looking for fine bridges, then on Teesside we've got two. To show what local engineers and labourers can do. There's one of them that lifts herself about to ship in its way. And the other shuttles back and forth a hundred times a day. The foreman and myself was going to the best. We passed 300 ton of steel, I'm sure it was no less. Says so see, this job looks bad for us, so fingers there's a glut. I am sure enough, a 12 month that our plant was shut. But I tell you, sons of Bromwich Gem, who makes us fancy cars, with fittings fine, electrical, and fruit and nut case bars, there's not a single one of you. They know the way we feel about this area of the north where we make British steel. Come on, sing. If you're looking for fine bridges, then on Teesside we go to. To show what local engineers and labourers can do. There's one of them that lifts itself about to ship its way. And the other shuttles back and forth a hundred times a day. If you're looking for fine bridges, then on Teesside we've got two. To show what local engineers and labourers can do. There's one of them that lifts herself about to ship in its way. And the other shuttles back and forth a hundred times a day. Teesside bridges, there you go.
And then last uh, last time I was here, uh, last time I was here, last time I was at a concert, uh, we were intercepted by an old friend of mine from down in Sussex, from Crawley. Uh, I remember the the good old days of the folk club in Crawley. What a great place it was. And I, I'd been learning a song. In fact, I recorded a song uh, that I heard from a guy called George Spicer, a famous traditional singer from Sussex. And I sang in the uh, in this pub. I forget the name of the pub now. But anyway, I sang in this pub. And uh, it happened to be, I was surprised, I was, I was really surprised afterwards, um, taken to a side after I sang this song. And I said, you know, George Spicer sang that song in exactly the same spot he used to at the bar and sang it. It was quite a moving experience. And George had a I had a son that was also a tremendous accordion player and singer. So this is a song I don't know George Spicer called The Faithful Sailor Boy. And this is for Fran. If you're listening, Fran, it's for you. <clears throat> it was a stormy winter's night. The snow lay on the ground. The sailor boy stood on the quay. His ship was outward bound. His sweetheart standing by his side Shed many a silent tear And as he held her to his breast He whispered in her ear Farewell, farewell, my own true love This parting brings me pain I'll be your own true guiding star When I return again my thoughts will be of you, of you as the storms are raging high. So fare thee well, remember me, your faithful sailor boy. <clears throat> Without a gale, the ship set sail, she's kissed as love goodbye. She watched the crop till out of sight and the tear bedimmed her eye. He prayed unto the heavens above to guide him on his way. His last and loving words that night re-echoed o'er the bay. Farewell, farewell, my own true love. This parting brings me pain. I'll be your own true guiding star when I return again. My thoughts will be of you, of you, as the storms are raging high. So fare thee well, remember me, your faithful sailor boy. But sad to say the ship returned without her sailor boy. He died whilst on the voyage back, a flag was half mast eye. And when his comrades came ashore, they told her he was dead. A letter he had sent to her, and the last line sadly said, Farewell, farewell, my own true love, on earth we meet no more. I soon shall be from storm and sea on that eternal shore i long to see you in that land that land beyond the sky where you will not be parted from your faithful sailor boy faithful sailor boy these are like the learning new songs again. Uh, George Vancouver and Faithful Sailor Boy were quite, uh, quite something to relearn. So thank you very much for challenging me with these requests from old material because it's a great exercise for me. Thank you. I hope you enjoyed the song, Fran. So I've got a couple of more requests. I've got uh, John Richard said the Chemical Workers song. I said, I could do that. I could do that. And um, we'll finish off with a one I'd like to sing for uh, Gilberto. Mm -hmm. 
So the first one is Chemical Worker Song. Now this is another song by Ron Angel, so uh, you get to feel this power he had. He used to sing these very mighty, powerful choruses. <clears throat> and in the Stockton Folk Club where I was brought up, the chorus singing was phew, remarkable. So the chorus is, go boys, go, they'll time you every breath. But every day you're in this place, you're two days nearer death, but you grow. Here we go. I parole says a man am I, and I'm telling you no lie. I work and breathe among the fumes, a trail across the sky. There's thunder all around me and poison in the air. There's a lousy smell that smacks a hell and the corn in me hair. And it's go, boys, go. I'll time you every breath. Every day you're in this place. You're two days near a death. But you go. I've worked among the spinners. I'm leaving the oil and smoke. I've shoveled up the gypsum and let nigh on makes you choke. I've stood knee deep in cyanide, gone sick with a caustic burn. I have lived it rough. I've seen enough to make your stomach turn. And it's go, boys, go. I'll time you every breath. Every day you're in this place, you're two days near a death, but you go. There's overtime and bonus opportunities galore, and young lads like the money, and they all come back for more. But soon you're knocking on, and look older than you should. I cut every bob, made on the job, it's a maid with a fresh and blood. And it's go, boys, go, they'll time you every breath. Every day you're in this place, you're two days near a death, but you go. A process of mad am I, and I'm telling you no lie. I work and breathe among the few, a chill across the sky. There's thunder all around me, and poison in the air. There's a lousy smell that smacks a hell, and the call in the air. And it's go, boys, go. They'll time you every breath, and every day you're in this place. You're two days nearer death, but you go, boys, go. They'll time you every breath, every day you're in place two days near a death but you go the chemical worker song thank you very much the chemical worker song thank you thank you john richards for joining us tonight we picked a couple of crackers there for me to sing thank you very much I think that one was um oh that was the little sorry <laughs> i think it was Hi Lorraine, by the way, it's nice to see you. If that was your request, uh, good on you, thank you very much. So I'm going to finish off now, uh, I'm sorry it's uh, our time to get, no, we're more or less on time. Any other requests I might have got last week or the last month, uh, I will catch up with next time, okay? <laughs> Now this is for Gilberto. I have a, uh, he's a, a great friend and a great supporter of my music, so I hope you like this. This is a song that was written really for Middlesbrough uh, Environment Department uh, when they were championing a new green environmental project. And they asked me to write this song to celebrate it. Uh, it's to them, we call it the town meal song, or um, 
good earth. But uh, our friends in uh, in Botton Village in the Camp Hill community, they call it the Botton song. And there's a lot of there's a lot of similarities between uh, the greening of Middlesbrough and the beautiful greenery of uh, of Danby Dale. So I'll say good night with us. Enjoy, and uh, I'll see you soon. The uh, there's a new album coming out up uh, November the first, but uh, you'll find details on the website in the next few days how you can pre-order. And uh, something I hope you'll enjoy when you hear it. Been really nice playing for you tonight. Thank you very much indeed for listening. Turmoil, the earth is in pain. As I walk down the street, no one calls out my name. They've knocked down the buildings, community's gone. As I walk through this glorious wilderness town. But among all the memories, chimneys and smoke, as in years long gone by, the air might make a joke. It's there I saw something I'd never have dreamed. There were gardens a growing, an oasis of green. Come sit at the table and drink of the wine. Taste food from our garden, the grape from our vine. A health to our neighbour and the seeds we have sown. And thank the good earth for the food that we grow. <clears throat> I look to the stars, touched by the moon. The trees gently swayed as they gave me a tune. And the earth raised her voice, echoing long. And they gave me the words that I wrote for a song. Brother Earth has the power to change for the good. You water your food and your whole neighborhood. She gave us the soil and the rain and the wind. And she gave us the power to change everything. Come on, sing. Come sit at the table and drink of the wine. Taste food from our garden, the grape from our vine. A health to our neighbour and the seeds we have sown. And thank the good earth for the food that we grow. <clears throat> so we planted our garden. We watered the land, we sowed and we hoed, and we raked it by hand. Like a grouse on a moor, raises her young, and grouts every seedling till it's fully grown. Then we cut it and pull it and harvest it in. The fruits of our labours are all gathered in. And we thank the good earth for the food that we've got From the garden it comes high and straight to the pot Come on, sing! Come sit at the table and drink of the wine Taste food from our garden, the grape from our vine A health to our neighbour and the seeds we have sown And thank the good earth for the food that we grow. And now all the food is well gathered up from allotment and field, I in greenhouse and hut. We bring it to the table, to this our town meal, and celebrate the earth and what it can yield. When we work together, each woman and man, we sing a close harmony song of the land. And we thank the good earth for the food that we've grown. 
at the building and neighborhood we can call home. Come sit at the table and drink of the wine, taste food from our garden, the grape from our vine, a health to our and the seeds we have sown, and thank the good earth for the food that we've grown. And begin, come sit and drink of the wine, taste food from our garden, the grape from our vine, a health to our neighbour and the seeds we have sown, and thank the good earth for the food that we've grown. Thanks everybody, thank you very much indeed for listening and we'll see you in about another month's time with some more songs. Brilliant, thank you very much for, for tuning in. Good night. See you later. <laughs> <coughs>